Nice. So we leave Melbourne for two weeks, and in that time, Nick breaks his ankle. Well, while the boys were away, I was getting a bit bored, so I went to uh, the hinterland, did some camping, got my foot caught in a bear trap. Drop bears everywhere in Australia. Today's video, we are... Getting rubbin tugs. <laughs> <laughs> after, after, after. Today, we are doing... Fake. Ikea worker. You guys loved the Woolworths, like, grocery store employee one we did, so we're like, we may as well run it back. Dan will be making his return. It's a natural progression. Chalky expert, meatball order. Swedish meatball Dan. <laughs> You guys went crazy in the last employee prank to bring back Chucky Expert Dan. Let us know where you want to see him go next. The only size we could get was a small. It's tiny. Barely fits me. Not sure how well this is going to work. <laughs> oh shit, it fits. That is so good. Cool. Are you going to have cleavage? <laughs> <laughs> They thought this was going to be a problem, that it might be a bit small, so they went and got yellows. <laughs> Yellow paint. <laughs> <laughs> shirt keeps creeping up, so I'm just like, I think I've done well, enough. Maybe, maybe oh. <laughs> What's the hardest mattress suit they've got on display here? What are we doing on it? Just you know, sleeping, of... it's, my, it's for my parents. Anything else but sleeping or just sleeping? Just sleeping. <laughs> Cut the crap. Bit of business. No, no. What I was going to say is that old saying, a bad tradesman always blames his tools. Yeah, okay. A bad shagger blames his bed. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh, the old Vatnestrom. That is one of the uh, top mattresses for shagging. Yeah, okay. Have we got that on display? Or? Well, I'm still not really picking up what you're trying to say. Sleeping or? Sleeping, 100% sleeping. sleeping. Just sleeping? Yeah, yeah. There's mattress. no subtle message here. Like, we're looking for a mattress that, that is firm. Is that one on display? We're you looking for one with good tie down spots? A bit of like. Mm -hmm. you know? What are you doing, mate? I'm trying what to sell you, you a mattress. I'm trying to tell you, I'm the best salesman in the game. Like, I'm kind of getting offended here because I'm looking for a mattress. I'm looking for help. I'm just being you're real. Not, you're not being professional at I'm all. I'm being real, though. How are you? This is for you, my lady. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, Don't be a soft cock, mate. All right. <laughs> oh, God. That'll be two dollars at the checkout. Yeah. Enjoy. All right. Have a good one. Why do you guys want to buy a chair? Why not? What? To sit on? Sorry, I just got to ask questions. It's 2022. You can't, you can't be surprised with any answer. People are walking around on eggshells. But you're going to sit on the chairs. Chairs good to sit on. Yeah. Table's good to eat on. If you just go like that, you can tell if it's a good wood. Mm. It's nice. This one? Yeah. Right here? Smart, Great for business. Don't tell you. Yeah. Top IKEA salesman by day. Uh, Bed whisper it by night. Wait, you're going to be sleeping on the mattress? Yeah. yeah. Just sleeping? Of course not. <laughs> Do you guys reckon you could recommend me if you buy it? Okay. Yeah. I've like led yellow and blue for so long. <laughs> I reckon I've sold the most mattresses out of anyone. You would buy it. I don't know if it would feel like it. After business? <laughs> You guys thinking of having coitus and then returning it? No, no. You can return it, but not after coitus, yeah, obviously. Cool. Uh, I'll leave you to it. Hi, you boys. I'm just going to cook some smoke or what? I'm just cooking a bit of bacon, because who likes the fucking meatballs here? Yeah. <laughs> Someone told me they're fucking dog meat. Well, I haven't even tried to see if this bloody works. It doesn't even fucking work. Three weeks ago, I was cooking at my house, and I started cooking moussaka and burnt down the fucking house. Shit. Sorry, yeah, yeah, sorry, can I have a hug? Yeah. So, just, gonna... just group hug. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Well, oh, I can't even fucking cook. I need fucking food. Don't speed. I believe in you. Thank you. You will prevail. When yeah. push comes to plunge, yeah. like, I keep pushing. Yeah, we have to. Yeah. We have to keep plunging. How's that old saying go? A good tradesman blames his tools. No. A bad shagger blames his bed. Something like that, isn't it? Do you walk here? Well, I'm uh, not wearing a fantastic okay, furniture good, good. outfit, so, am I? So I? I was thinking about this. Uh, I wouldn't recommend this one because no tie down spots. I would like to check the another one then. Yes? Hmm? You into that stuff? Mm hmm. It's still good for all the rest of it, like getting down to business and all that. 
business. <laughs> this one, if you just really want to get down to business, that's what it's for. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I just, I'm a bit sleepy. Oh, gosh, it's that time of the day, you know? Yeah. Bar out, and you go home. that. Yep, that one's good. I've uh, actually been opening a couple out and nicking a few screws, but that one's all good. Oh, Hasn't cool. got a slice in it. Yeah, I just didn't want you to <laughs> get you. a bad one. Yeah, the boss. Been on my case, like Cochrane on Simpson. <laughs> am I right? Yeah, so I've just been Double checking him. causing him a few more issues, so then he's got less time to watch me like a hawk. Caca! Caca! Been in here for legit 45 minutes. I'm going to pass out. It's so hot. I need air. Jesus, mate. <laughs> Bloody hell, you're blowing my cover. Tracy's been looking for me, and she's not happy. Okay. Have you guys seen her? No. No? She's about this tall, brown hair, waddles around like she's got a carrot up her ass. No? <laughs> fellas, fellas, she caught me sleep sleeping on the display bed, but I was on my break, uh -huh. and if anything, it's just good product placement. You know what I'm saying? I know what and you're she's, she's just been chewing my ear off ever since. Oh shit, really? is that, is that Tracy? Wait, stand here, pretend we're um, helping you. I cut that, cut that. <laughs> it was so hot in that Ikea. I'm legit steaming. I was actually in there for like at least an hour and oh, my sweats were sweating. Can you smell it? Just kidding, you know yeah. they're not real, don't you? Yeah, yeah, was it, did you see me sniffing it? I didn't do that. No, you just know they're not real though. <laughs> they're not real. Just, of course, yeah. yeah. We're just trying to see if they'll look okay. Yeah, what's that saying? Let an idiot know if they're looking like an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, did I actually just say that? No. Yeah, yeah, I saw you sniffing it, you know. But. <laughs> Caught in the act, don't worry about it. <laughs> but they're not real. Yeah, yeah, so these aren't real, just letting yeah. you know. Cool. Thank you, thank you. Out we get. Yeah. Up to any business in here? No. Oh gosh, I've just had a few rumours that a few couples have been no, no. <laughs> in here and I'm just making sure. Because yeah. I don't stand for that, not on my bloody sofas. Fair enough. Get out of here. Swedish meatball Dan. <laughs> Definitely trying to think of something to say there. Sometimes I just can't. We're looking for people who care about people. I'm just auditing the meatballs. The meatballs are pretty good at the store, right? I think they're okay. I ordered the meatballs yeah. around the world. So I went to Sydney last week, they're pretty average. You just gotta go on the other side if you don't have the hair net. Can you grab me a hair net? Yeah. Thank you. Do you go through security? No, no, I'm just uh, checking the meatballs. Go on. Okay. Go on. You should go to Stockholm and try them. They're pretty good in Stockholm. Stockholm? Sweden. I don't think I want to travel all the way there, though. It's worth it for meatballs. Like. Not just for meatballs. Swedish meatball expert, Dan. They send me all around the world to test these meatballs out. The guy over there, I tried to offer this to No, over there. Yeah, Swedish meatball expert Dan. I'm just ordering the uh, meatballs. Okay, you need to get on that side. Do you want some meatballs? No, that's fine. Can you please sure. get out? <laughs> Pretty good, the meatballs, right? Go in the lift, quick. <laughs> Thank you, you can come around the corner any second now. But <laughs> <laughs> no, wrong way. It's from. <laughs> Meatball yeah. expert. What are you doing? Testing yeah. the meatballs. I go around to every country in the world and test the uh, meatballs at Ikea's. You're using our trademark. So I'm just known for like testing meatballs. I don't really care. Apologize. Dan, what you're known for. You're not welcome. Sorry, we'll, 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 we'll leave. Please ask your friend to stop filming, please. I'll take it off. Yeah, hold this. No, of course, I understand. Of course. Jesus. Tell them about that story how you know how to say meatballs. Oh, chocolate et potatoes moist. 
is Swedish meatballs and mash. <laughs> oh, I did it. Don't say it like that. You're an idiot. Oh, we'll get out of here. Bye, Kia. I'll have meatball. Dude, they stink so bad. Nah, they're so yummy, though. Don't plenty in the wishing well. Oh, I'm always gonna wish you well.